our mantra for the company is train and recover the way that you move. We are trying to revolutionize tradition. If you look at a lot of the current equipment that's in the market on the fitness side and on the rehab side, there exists a huge opportunity for disruption. My name is Sam Miller. I'm the CEO of Boston Biomotion, and we're developing a intelligent rehabilitation and training tool for the 21st century. Regimens and protocols and methods haven't changed in a very long time. People in the marketplace, whether it's a trainer or a physical therapist, they're limited by equipment and tools that are available for use. We want to make this easier for them with something that's actually designed for the human body. My father invented the hardware at the biomechanics lab at MIT. And at the time, the technology was very expensive. And also, a lot of the technology that we're now using did not exist. His intent was to build something that allowed a user to exercise and train for sport, harnessing the power of the human body. There is a huge demand for health data, and you can see that through motion tracking systems and wearable technology. What hasn't been done is perform those functional motions with resistance and track and record all of that activity. The device is broken into three stages. When activated together, allow for movement in three separate planes of motion. In addition to actually accommodating those motions, we're applying resistance that's totally customizable in those different planes. You should be experiencing 100% muscle exertion and efficiency at every point along any trajectory. That type of resistance is akin to moving in a fluid. It's almost like aquatic therapy on land. And we call that resistance collinear resistance. We want to provide a level of insight that hasn't been available for anyone trying to improve their body. I thought you said it'd be big. It's pretty big, right? I have big pieces Decent of equipment. Say you thought it was it's cool. get inside. It's cool. It's like a robot. My name is Pierce Hutchings, exercise physiologist, own a personal training academy where I train and certify personal trainers. Do side to side one more time. Keep going. Feel a little resistance there? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Anywhere you move it, it feels like you're moving in a fluid, right? So you can move it in a circle. <laughs> right? It's kind of crazy, honestly, but I love it. Right, so get a little creative with it. A golf training. You know when we do cables? Yep. You know we'll have like two hand and they just do their swing? Yeah. But we can only do on either the down or you can do the up. Right. You can't do the whole thing. You can't do the whole swing. That's exactly the idea. You just switch the handle out, you can do something That's for like a dual That's really arm. hard to do. It's impossible to do. But yeah, what we have now, yeah. You weren't kidding, this is cool. <laughs> We're not just tracking athletes and how they move and their movement patterns. We're actually building a better athlete. This will produce more fatigue resistant muscle groups around complex joints like a shoulder or a knee, accelerate injury recovery, and reduce the likelihood of future injury. The shoulder is so vulnerable for injury because it does so much in terms of the range of motion. I'm Courtney Jensen. I am a professor at a university in California, and my area of interest is human performance and the context of the injured athlete. The variable that predisposes people to injury is have they been injured before? It's the changing mechanical patterns. You're overcompensating, you're using different body segments to produce the same force. If you can get back to normal mechanics, if you can replicate that, your risk of re-injury is gonna come down. BBI is a billion dollar company because if you look at the total addressable market, 210,000 facilities with the opportunity for not just a single device sale per location and a recurring revenue stream from uh, our software model. If you do that multiplication out, we're looking at a $10 billion opportunity. I have a firm belief that this is something that can help anyone trying to improve their body. This is the full integration of an assessment tool and a training tool into one device. We want people to return to work faster, we want them to get back on the field, and we want them to be able to maintain their peak performance.